In small Colorado towns like Kingsburg, convenience isn't hard to come by when everything you need is on the same block. But mass vaccine sites are miles away from people who live in places like Weld County. So two weeks ago, the state started bringing mobile clinics to them. So far, uh, the mobile uh, vaccine clinics have been a huge success. Deb Suniga is uh, one of right the state's deputy directors for vaccine equity clinics. She says the mobile buses are kind of a game changer because the concept is all about ease and accessibility. That's why we had done the Johnson & Johnson because it was a one, uh, one step vaccination. For two weeks, the buses have helped fully vaccinate people in hard to reach areas across the state. Now that the Johnson & Johnson vaccine is on hold, they've switched to administering the Pfizer vaccine, which means they'll have to find the time to come back for their second dose. For people who live out in the rural areas, uh, one shot, uh, dose is perfect. Eric Aiko works with the Weld County Health Department. He says they currently have about 5,000 doses of the J&J &J vaccine stored away and ready to go once they get the green light. Yes, we are at a pause and yes, it will be inconvenient for some people. Um, however, we still have lots of vaccine available and we are doing lots of vaccinations still. So if you want a vaccine, we can still get you a vaccine and there's lots of options for you. In the meantime, Eric and Deb say their priority continues to be making sure access to the vaccine isn't an issue. It was just a couple of days putting this behind, but we're back up and running. Victoria De Leon, Nine News.